I'm Stephen Ehrlich. And I'm Takashi Anai. And we're the co-designers of this house. It's the Korea residence in Pacific Palisades. And today is the AIA home tour. That's why you see people walking around. And there are a number of uh, interesting organizational features of this house. Uh, well, <laughs> basically what the client wanted from us was the development of two outdoor spaces. So what we did, instead of having your traditional front yard, house, backyard, we pushed the house to the edge of the property. So what we wind up with is a very generous side yard, uh, and that becomes the family yard. And then in the back, we have a adult entertainment yard. So that was very important. And the house is very porous. As you can see, there are these large pivot doors that pivot open. So the indoor space and the outdoor space can truly fuse together. Uh, we also have an infinity pool. There's a beautiful canyon view and ocean view as well. Right. The views are very important. So one thing you'll notice right away when you enter the compound is we developed uh, the living room space as a glass jewel box that you can see through. So even from the family yard, you can see through the living room and the canyon view beyond that. There's also an organizational series of stone walls. You can see them as you enter into the house. And that stone wall, which is very thick, about three feet thick, uh, actually creates a kind of a, a depth and a, and a, a weight to the, to the house. Uh, because there's also a lot of lightness to the house, including this large plane, uh, this roof plane, which has a wood ceiling and copper fascia. So we chose for the house a very minimal uh, material palette. So Stephen mentioned the stone. And then upstairs we have everything on a, uh, in a stucco mass. Hey guys, a stucco mass, that's the bedroom volume upstairs that kind of slides past the stone uh, that's holding it up. And then we have the living room, which is just the glass box and the uh, wood ceiling. And the, all the materials carry from indoor to outdoor. So the idea is that it's really about Southern California living, living indoors and outdoors. The floor is a concrete floor. Actually, the, there's an interesting juxtaposition of very uh, fundamental basic materials like concrete, concrete floor. We expose it. We do put some uh, pigment in it. Uh, and that is in contrast to some of the higher grade finishes like walnut cabinetry, uh, the stone walls that we spoke about, et cetera. One thing you'll notice about the geometry of the house, and this is a little trivia about the house, that is the one angle of the house that is uh, non-orthogonal. Um, and that is a reflection of the property line. So actually the angle of the pool is also reflected as the same angle as the, as the, uh, the, the master bedroom ceiling wall.